Before the break, we watched as the Buckeyes beat Michigan in a thrilling double overtime victory, then watched the fans storm the field for the celebration. Well, they weren't the only ones out in full force. Fans right here in Toledo were supporting their teams from afar. Brandon. Christina, it was a record breaking 110,045 down in Columbus today, and what a show they got as Ohio State taking on Michigan was one for the ages. But those that were not able to make their way to Columbus today still had quite the show to take in. And those diehard fans up here in Toledo, whether Ohio State or Michigan, were definitely enjoying the festivities. It is time for the big game. Whether you fly your Block M proudly or have been a Buckeye since birth, Northwest Ohio has taken to the front lines in the battle between Michigan and Ohio State faithful. I don't know, it's really fun, exciting, great atmosphere, I guess. In Sylvania, the Nichols family breaking in their new house today by hosting a watch party with maize and blue as far as the eye can see. Just having a good time, eating, drinking, um, hanging out with friends, They're doing it like we should. Excited to have a housewarming slash Michigan Ohio State party with all of our close friends and all of our little kids. Um, we're having a great time. Just south of Toledo in Oregon, the Cascadon household feeling much more scarlet and gray, erupting in a roar during this roller coaster edition of the greatest rivalry in sport. <laughs> Awesome. You know, I play volleyball in the fall, so I'm not really able to watch many games. So coming home, especially this weekend, means a lot. No matter the outcome of this game and whether you shout <laughs> or oh, wait. the bond that is attached to this Michigan Ohio State rivalry is certain not to be broken in this region anytime soon.